Hey guys, welcome to your channel. In this video, you'll learn on how to use Envato Elements in Filmora. So first thing that you should do is you have to go to Envato Elements website. And then do not forget that you have to subscribe to a plan in order for you to download the elements and use it in Filmora. So just open your web browser and then type out Envato Elements. And as you can see, I have successfully logged in to my Envato account. And of course, I have subscribed to a plan in order for me to use their elements. You can also upgrade your plan to annual if you want to so you can get more discount okay and then once you're here you will then just have to scroll down and you'd be able to see here the top categories and the similar finds but of course right here at the top left you'd be able to see this all item section so when you click on it we have here the stock videos and more Okay, so when you click on this one, we have video templates, music, sound effects, graphic templates, graphics, presentation templates, photos, fonts, add-ons, and more. Okay, now when you click on this option right here, for example, I would want to use this template. So you will then just have to click on that specific template. Okay, and then after that, if you think this template is good and you are after into light effects for transition so this is optic light flares transition and then the application supported is premiere pro so don't worry because we can still use this template using filmora okay so what you're going to do here is we have to download this template so just click on download and right here you can create a new project or you can um, save it to an existing project. So for example, here on the sample, after that, you will then just have to click on Add on Downloads. Next is you just have to save it in your folder. So you just click on Save and then just have to wait for a couple of seconds until you be able to download the zip file for this template. Okay, so once you downloaded this template, so you just have to go to your files okay so just go to your computer files because we have to extract this first okay so before we can use this one in filmora we gotta go here okay so let me just go to this section okay so here is a template so you just have the right click and then click on extract all so once you do that you will then just have to click on extract and then just wait for a couple of seconds then after that you will then just have to open your filmora application okay so before that here let's go to the asset section okay and then go to the video okay and then here I'd be able to see all of the effects or the elements that we can use okay so now let us open our filmora then here is we are going to drag and drop the media and effects to create our video so first i'm going to drop here the main video that we are going to use so i just have to click on click here and then go to your folder and then select the video that you are going to use okay so let me just find another video that i can use okay so after that you'll then just have to simply click on no or yes and then just drag and drop the main file right here okay and then just have it to select your resolution okay so i'm going to use this one next is we are going to play this video if it is working so now that it is all good let us add now the effects or the elements from envato so just click on the add icon once again and i suggest to create your folder first okay so i created my invader folder so i can add here all of the elements that i have downloaded and then go to that specific template and then go here and go to the video section and then what you're going to do here is you just have to select all of the effects that you are going to add okay so i'll just select them and then click on open so once done, all you have to do now is to simply drag and drop the effects above your main video. So for example, right here, 
So you have the option if you want to add all of the effects all together or you want to add them one by one. So I'm going to add this one by one. So I'm just going to select one and then drag and drop it above the main video. Then I just have to add another once again. Okay, so let me just add more effects before we are going to use this and overlay these effects to our main video. Okay, so let me just add one more. Okay, and then I would like to add this one over here as well. So after that, you just have to select that specific element or that effects and go to the blend mode. Okay. And let me just try to play the video. As you can see right here, when the effects appear, our main video disappear. It is because we did not blend it well with our main video. So what we can do is we have to select all of the effects that we have added in this section. Okay, so let me just um, select all of this right here. So just click on control and then select all of the element or effects that you have added. And then right here, the right side, be able to see the blend mode. So you just have to click on it and then make sure to select the screen option. Okay, so when you click on screen and then try to play this video, as you can see, we have successfully added the element without covering our main video. Okay, so before we end this video, I'm going to show you, of course, on how we can trim our main video and how we can add more videos so that we can really use the elements or the transition effects or the transition lights from Envato. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to select this clip or the stream icon and then I'm just going to drag it right here. And I would like to add a new um, clip right here. So I'm going to click on the stream option and I'm going to delete this clip. Okay, so after deleting that specific clip, what you're going to do next is we have to add another clip from our computer. Okay, so just click on the add option once again. And then you just have to go to your folder okay so let me just add here the clip so you just have to drag and drop it right here so of course i am going to trim the second clip that i have added so you just have to drag the trim option once again okay and then i'm going to delete this clip and then i'm going to add this short clip but before that i'm going to trim this once again and then let us try to play this video now okay so as you can see, we have successfully as mentioned, added the light video. effects as well as a new clip after that effects that we have added from Envato. So that's it for this video. If you think this video helped you solve your concern, please subscribe, like this video, and leave your comment below. Bye.